That's right. We just heard from Public Works Director Dr. Charles Williams, who says progress was made today after they took several steps back yesterday as the pressure dropped. Now, the city says today that PSI is back up to 85, and the city wants to keep that pressure up. They say that is their priority right now. Dr. Williams says still certain areas in West and South Jackson are still with little to no pressure, and that includes high elevated areas as well. He says crews are going throughout the city checking fire hydrants for air and water flow within the system to measure their progress. The city says if they continue to see progression, there's a chance that the boil water notice could be lifted soon. As our tanks continue to fill, if we don't make any uh, regressions back, I will be able to start sampling and hopefully start lifting the boil water notice. So that is a positive thing. But what could cause further setbacks is water main breaks. Right now, the city says that number is in the low 20s, which is typical for their system, according to Dr. Williams. But he says they are seeing about four to five new ones each day. And it, to keep that pressure up, crews will have to continue fixing active breaks and keeping up with the new breaks. As of this afternoon, Dr. Williams says his crews are all caught up. Live at City Hall, Cecil Hannibal, 16 WAPT News.